tonight we are going to look at how to describe a picture okay it can be a picture or an incident right so yeah so since musna is the first to go let's hear from musna musna can you say one or two sentence about this picture ah uh, yes sir uh, i think uh, this is a, a class a classroom for um, the students of higher studies mm -hmm. um the students are very keen to um, study and uh, good attention to sir or teacher mm -hmm. mm. uh, the sir uh, the teacher is um, the teacher is trying to telling uh, something uh, to students okay just a minute now let's go to another person ayomi uh there are two students for one table mm -hmm. children are not writing and they are listening mm -hmm. children are not writing and they are listening okay now let me pick up this only sentence for the time being uh, I'll quickly share this one. Children are not writing and listening. Right? Okay. Whenever you say, I think I have already explained this to the class. When we say both plus, we have to say and. If we say one minus and one plus, one good and one bad, or one. But. Uh, we have to say but, yes. Children are not writing but listening. Yes. Okay. Yes. Children are not writing but listening. Perfect. Correct. Perfect. All right. So next, uh, let's move on to the photos okay so now yeah that was good Ayomi and Shara Shara let's get another photo yeah Shara tell us something about this photo please are you interested to describe about this photo uh, yeah, sir. yes Say only one or two. Yeah, say only one or two this sentences. Show a fair, fair or shop. Okay. There are two ladies are buying something vegetables. Mm -hmm. There are so many vegetables in that. Um, in that market, that market. Uh, okay. market okay this side is um, this is a for and this this is like something for inside market mm -hmm. outside market okay you mean it's a it's a it's an outdoor market it's not an indoor market outdoor but an outdoor market, market. Yes. yeah Okay. Uh, All right. That, that's that's fair enough. And let's hear okay, from Pradhaban. Pradhaban, I give you another photo. Uh, Kalla? Yes, Pradhaban. Uh, this is a bedding suit photos. 
it's a wedding shoot that's enough hello yeah 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 uh one two three four five five couples there yeah. okay okay and one two three four four children there yeah. mm -hmm. okay uh, in, in between uh, uh there are there are five couples this r is very important uh, four children are, four sorry. children are there four children there is wrong four children or four girls or four flower girls uh, flower not flower so our people pronounce it flower were is not there f l o w though the spelling is f l o w uh, we do o w e r we don't pronounce it flower it's flower flower it's o u r okay flower so there are four flower girls there are four they are not not they are four flower flower girls okay yes continue please brother okay some uh i think the main couples in byton in uh, white color resin lady mm -hmm. okay another couples another couple are in yellow color res mm -hmm. okay yellow Okay that's yeah, good. Micro. That's good. That's good. That's pretty enough. Yes. Now let me jump towards yes. Saima Khan. Good evening sir. Yes, very good evening. How are you? I'm great. Okay. So this photo is for you to describe a little about it. The same photo which is given to Pradaban? Yes. Do, okay. okay so uh, it's a shoot of a wedding i think someone's uh, wedding is there photo wedding photo is there mm -hmm. and uh, there are five couples uh, and they have followed the same theme that is sari and coat mm -hmm. uh, the females have uh, followed the theme that is they are wearing sari mm -hmm. and the males which are there they wore a coat pant mm -hmm. uh and um, mm, the couples are looking beautiful mm -hmm. and uh, it's a time uh, uh, the uh, the wedding is uh, the photo shoot has taken in the time of morning mm -hmm. at the time of morning mm -hmm. and um, uh, there are four flower girls mm -hmm. uh, two are very tiny and the other two are uh, i would say they, their age is around 10 to 12 Ten, eight to ten, eight to ten years old, mm. and uh, hmm, what else? What else can I say? How about the background? That's it. I think background is sunny. Uh, the the weather is sunny, mm. and uh, uh, the background is uh, really very beautiful. It's very greeny. I would say, mm. uh, greeny. Yeah, greenish. Okay. greenish, greenish. yeah Fine. a very perfect. natural yeah natural natural background that's perfect yeah brilliant so now let's ask uh oh this photo isn't very clear uh though this for kisho kisho Mr Leo we have a rule in our group that if someone is not responding to a certain time we would not allow the person to be part of the group because of our bad experience by allowing uh, people to the group so if you don't mind please give an introduction now so that we would allow you to remain in the group
Are you there, Leo? Leo? So I hope you heard my message. I'm sorry that I would, I would remove you from the group as of now. And you join back again once you are available. So I think now you are online and not available. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I have removed Leon. Leon. Uh, yes. Now, Kisho, Kisho. Can you hear me? About the picture. Mm. I won't see. No, not very clear. Yes. It's all right. Just uh, remain. Just stay on online. Javad Ahmed. Hello. Yes, yes. Yes, sir. How are you, Javad? <coughs> I'm fine. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Okay. I'm great. Thank you for asking me. But still, your network is also uh, poor. So, without wasting the time, let's move on to other people. So, let me ask. Uh, let me ask about. Now. Now is yeah better. Now I think it. Good. Um, not very good actually okay anyway uh, now let's go to Kavinash Kevin okay. how are you Kevin okay so I said I'm fine what's the how question sir uh, yes Kevin say something uh, about yeah I think uh, there was the raining uh, since uh, two days so the signal is too weak that's all right, Javad. Uh, just remain online and uh, we will continue. Whenever it is all right with your network, we'll come back to you. Kevin? Hi, sir. Yes, Kevin. Say something about this photo. Mm. This is a picture of a market. This is a picture of a market. Okay, good. Um, we can see many kind of vegetables and fruits in this picture. Okay, good. Um, uh, a person is sweep, uh, sweeping the floor. Mm. He's sweeping, um, yeah. And um, <clears throat> what is the shopkeeper doing? Shopkeeper is uh, looking at the photographer. Great. Yeah. It's also another sentence. If you want to write uh, 100 words about this photo, you can say that one also. Okay. That was brilliant. Brilliant. Perfect. So let me ask some more sentences about this photo from Muzna. Yes, sir. Yes. Um, uh, there are uh, so many variety of vegetables. Mm -hmm. um, um, the lot of uh, labels are arounding the um, arounding in front of the shops. Um, uh, standing. You mean standing in front of the shop? Yeah. Laborers. Uh, they are, yeah. Okay. And they mm -hmm. also can be customers. <laughs> so you can say there are uh, many or a lot of, a lot of, uh, should be there, a lot of uh, customers and workers. 
okay so why are we using that a lot uh, we can use a lot only uh, no many or a lot that is not a lot a lot uh -huh. is different word a lot is allocate uh, that's meaning uh, we are mentioning something that's uh, yeah what uh, is okay. that whose mic is it Whose mic is that? Someone is shouting. Okay. Oops. Uh, all right. Yes, yeah. fine. So a lot is allocate something. A lot is many. A space L O T. So a lot. That is a lot. Uh so when then, then a lot mean uh, something one something one is it lot is lot lot of okay. or a lot of lot of or a lot of that is a lot a lot with between a and lot there should be a small break a lot uh -huh. is it okay okay the, that that we call stress point uh, or intonation. So there must be a little stress point. A lot. A lot. That is a lot. A lot. Yeah. Okay. Um, Good. Shall I continue? Yes, please. Okay. Yes, please. Okay. Um, uh, one of the owner is uh, looking at the cameraman. One of the owners. Uh, when you say one of, one of, one of Always the noun should be in plural. One of my friends, one of the schools, one of the books. Then always the noun should be in plural. One of is always the noun in plural. Yeah, good. Go ahead. Um, there are, um, uh, I think uh, there, there are the uh, labors or customers are picking the... Um, fallen vegetables mm. uh, to put in the um, put in the bag mm. um, good workers yeah. are collecting yeah very good yeah. very good very good very good right let's uh, let's go Thank to the other sir. one ayomi uh, about this photo uh, there is a paddy field. This photo is of a, for a paddy field. This, this photo, photo is... of a paddy field. Okay. Uh, and uh, many women, many women. Mm -hmm. uh, Good. Women. <laughs> many women. Women. Well, there are many well, women. There are many women and women. they work women. Yes, good. Women. women. Yeah. There are many women and mm. they work uh, at that paddy field. Okay. Mm, and there are many men. Mm. Men. There are many men. There men. are many three. No, there are three men. Mm. Mm. helping the plantation or cultivation so what are these women doing anybody can anybody say about what are these women doing they are planting planting very good yes uh, Cora Lafia yeah hello yes how are you, Cora Lafia? To, I'm fine, thanks. What about you? I'm good, great. Thank you very much for asking Happy me. Happy to and hear that. Could you introduce a little bit about yourself, please, since you are a new person? Okay, no, no, no problem, no problem. <laughs> so I'm Kadai Lafia. Mm -hmm. I'm from Benin Republic in West Africa. Okay, Benin. Oh, yeah, oh. exactly, in West Africa. Okay, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. So I would like to say something about this picture. Yes, please. So according to me, it is not planting 
that is transplanting, transplanting, because it is not directly. Absolutely. They are transplanting. Yes. It is a transplantation, not a plantation. It's a transplantation. Yeah. What does transplanted, transplantation mean? Yeah. So transplantation, they, it, yes. Okay. Transplantation means plant some seed in a place and later when it reaches its young age, remove it and bring it to another place and plant it again. So that is trans, transplantation. So here they, these people, these women are transplanting uh, paddy seeding. That can be also seeding, I think. But uh, we also can say young uh, crop. Transplanting young crop. Yeah. Cora, yes, uh, Cora Lafia. Okay, so I would like to ask uh, some uh, a question. I don't know. Yes. This is a paddy or a, a bird, it is the uh, harvest is paddy. This one, I think it is uh, the plant or I don't know, young plants. I don't know. Yeah, what is paddy? Paddy is the harvest of the rice, the product we, we get after harvest. Okay. Okay, I'll I'll uh, check that word, uh, but since it's uh, it's um, yeah, so yes, fine. Um, that's that's a good remark. That's a good comment. Uh, a field planted with rice growing in water. Yeah. So paddy is the rice plant. Uh, Mr. Koralafia? Yeah, I hear you, I hear you. Yeah, so Cambridge Dictionary says, uh, paddy is rice paddy. In, in US English, they call it rice paddy. And paddy uh, means a field planted with rice growing in water. Okay, thank you very much. You are welcome. And uh, you are also right in that uh, sense, it's a field. It's a field planted with rice growing in water. Yeah, correct, yes. Okay, thanks. Uh, I reread it once uh, to make it sure. Uh, fine, perfect. So, yes, and have you some more things to add, please? No, that's all for the moment. Okay. Right. So there are more people. Um, Mukhtar Magzam. Magzam? Yes, Deja. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Are you Deja? Yeah, I'm great. Thank you. And you are new to the class, aren't you? Yes, teacher. I'm new class. I'm in a new student. Okay, good. Uh, Somaya El Room. Yes, Somalaikum. Walaikum salam. How are you? I'm fine, alhamdulillah. Uh, where are you from, Somaya? I'm from Egypt. Egypt, okay. Fine, great. So yes, so now tonight we are looking about how to describe or talk about some pictures or scene or incidents that are given. Okay, so for the time being we are looking at this picture and with some creative insights from Cora Lafia we are moving to another picture. Uh, okay. Uh, we, uh, we, yes. We, yes. Can, we can see the shadows of women in the water. In the water, yes. Yeah. Women's shadows are seen in the water. Yes, perfect. 
Do you want to say something about the background, uh, Ayomi? Uh, there are many trees and there are many rocks. Mm. What type of yeah. trees do you see the most? Coconut, coconut, coconut trees. trees. Yeah. It should be some tropical uh, country. Yeah, fine. Good, great. So let's move to the next image. Okay. Uh, let's hear Javad Ahmed Yusuf. Yes, sir. Wow, now your voice is really clear. And uh, yes, tell us one or two sentences about this photo. So this picture tells us uh, about the education. So there was a class and uh, one is teacher and there are students and the teacher asked from one student to, I think, to ask a question. Mm -hmm. to, uh, to answer the question which is written on the board. Mm. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, I think uh, there is uh, a graph uh, on the board, and the te teacher asked from one uh, student uh, to uh, to solve. I think so to solve this question. Mm. Good, well presented. And how many uh, boys are there in the? classroom uh, only three I think in front of class only three are sitting in front of class okay. and uh, the rest of these all are mm, female uh, students yeah okay and how about the teaching yeah, age? And, uh, I think these are the class of uh, Japanese or Korean class Japanese or Korean? I keep talking. I think it's what? English. Yeah, me mean that the students are Japanese. So I said that uh, uh, the students are Japanese or Korean. Mm. So countries like Japan, Korea, China, we have a particular name. Have you heard about that name? Uh, no. Have, have anybody I, heard about that name? I didn't hear about that. Okay, Cora Lafia. Oh, no idea. I don't. No idea. I so don't they know they are called that. Orientalists. Orientalists. Orientalists mean people from that type of countries like Japan, Korea, China, uh, and a little closer to Singapore, uh, Taiwan, and so on. So those people are called Orientalist countries people, or Orientalists. All right, so this could be one of an Orientalist uh, schools. Yes, Ayomi? Can you spell the word? O R I E uh, Orientalist Orientalist O R I E and T A L I S T. Sir, may I know, you know that audience means uh, people from uh from east asia east asia yeah like japan china uh uh korea um taiwan and so on that 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 is that's the their uniform that is kind of a, a particular name for them the, okay sir that is so this is a classroom of an orientalist uh, country okay right that's really good 
So, um, yes, I want to hear something from uh, Mr. Koralafia also. Uh, Javad, have you, are you done? Uh, no, so I have a question that what are these people called? You said, but I didn't hear that. Uh, that is uh, Orientalists. I... Okay, I have typed it in the chat box. Orientalists. Yeah. Okay, Orientalists. Okay. I'm going yeah. to. Okay. Can, sir, can I, sir, can you please okay, uh, no, spelling, okay. spelling me, sir? O R I E N T. A L I S T. Okay, sir. Fine. Check the spelling, or I will also um, send it in the chat uh, to everyone. Okay. I have put it in the chat box so everyone can look at it. Uh, fine. So let me hear something from uh, Somia El Room about yes, this um, picture. Can I, you say? I have a problem. In, I can't make. Uh, I, I don't have a lot of vocab. So um, when I try to make a sentence, I missed. That's fine. That is why you are here. And my job is to improve your speaking ability and help you to improve your vocabulary. So try. Is it a good deal? Thank you. Yes, thank you. Yes, it is. OK. So let's try Somia, uh, Somaya without hesitation. Yes. So be motivated. Step front and try okay i will try um here in this picture i think um uh, some student um discuss with his uh, with her teacher with their teacher okay okay good and maybe they have a break in the class Maybe it's a break, okay. Yeah, possible because people are talking to each other. Yeah, that is possible guess. Okay, great. Uh, let me hear something from uh, one or two sentences from Mr. Cora Lafia. Okay, thanks. <laughs> uh, so to be honest, uh, I don't have uh, some, something to say about that because uh, as a uh, my friend, uh, my two last friend, uh, said it is a classroom. And uh, of course, you of course, but yeah, there are some points. It is, there yeah, are some and, points still. Oh, yeah. Yeah, as you completed, it is an Orientalist countries. Mm. Uh, this kind of class, I don't know, something like that. So, <laughs> so fine. But what, what type of what teaching? Can, what type of teaching aid are they using? The type of teaching aid that that sorry teaching aid teaching um, instrument teaching facilities okay 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 uh, uh, can i first start? of all i can say it is a face-to-face -face, uh, teaching and uh, uh, the teacher projects the course uh, in the spotlights i think uh, exactly that is exactly what i wanted yeah. to hear from you yeah so the teacher yeah. is using a multimedia projector to teach yeah. yeah yeah and in the same time she's using whiteboard whiteboard yeah whiteboard at the back what this is whiteboard she's writing something on this and she has a pre-designed presentation slide show and projected with a multimedia projector What is that presentation, sir? Uh, we cannot see that. Okay. I, I don't know, actually. All right. Uh, so, uh, it is a graphic presentation. 
what is that graphic presentation graphic graphic okay graphic. yeah yeah graphic yeah. yeah yeah can yes okay now let's move on to this picture Mukhtar yes uh, can you say something about this picture please one or two sentences can you see and uh, Victor and tomato and people naming you and you don't know other things like tomato we use fruit in this country Sija. this uh, I don't know just a guess no problem just say it's from Africa one of the African countries that's okay. Yes. Uh, yeah, I'm Africa. Yeah, <laughs> that's all right. No problem. So here, yes. look at this roof. You can say about this roof and about this building. The background, the building in the background yes. is very old. So they should, um, you can say a lot of things about the government and so on, on this picture. So if you want to write 100 words about this picture, you can start blaming on the government of this country. Yes, teacher. This picture you can see, and this and all the uh, all the building and in front of and people uh, and behind of people. Sorry, behind of people mm. and all the all the wall on and roof and and large bush. Mm. Good, great, great, great. Okay, now let's hear from uh, who is there? Mm, I want to hear this question from someone who knows this. Yes, and playing golf. This is not golf. Yes. This is what is this? Iomi. Maybe crickets. Cricket. Okay. This is uh, yes. cricket. Cricket match. Cricket. Cricket match. Cricket yeah. or golf. This is cricket. Yes, yes, yes. This is cricket. And let's let's hear from Iomi one or two sentences about this picture. Uh, this is a picture of a cricket match. Mm -hmm. Uh, someone, some uh, one cricketer was uh, one cricketer was outing, mm -hmm. and others, others uh, was happy. Others, others is happy. Are happy. happy. Are happy. Okay. Others are happy. Uh, I don't know what. What is the country? Okay, no problem. Let, let's hear from Muzna. Muzna? Uh, yes, sir. Yeah. Two, can, three sentences. Yeah, can you hear me? Sir? Yes, yes, I can. Yeah. Um, I think uh, um, uh, the, the, bowling, uh, the bowling team is very happy to... Um, uh, happy to uh, uh, celebrate that that uh, out. that in, that the moment out. out of a batsman that uh, out of a batsman yeah, out of the batsman mm. Mm, yeah uh, I think the batsman is very sad uh, because of their uh, because of his uh, fault. Mm. Um, he is attempt. He is attempting to. Uh, uh, he is attempting to. Um, um, uh, that uh, wear off that uh, gloves. Us. Take to take uh, off his gloves. Yeah, yeah, to remove his gloves take or take off, off his, his gloves. Uh, gloves. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. good. Remove that's his enough. Gloves. Yeah. Okay, okay, that's enough. Yeah. And Kishore? Yes, yeah, sir. Yes. This is a cricket match. 
this is uh, this match uh, England versus Australia. How did you? How uh, do you know that? How did you guess uh, it? The, the uh, Kelmut uh, England uh, bench. On the batsman's I helmet. Can, yeah, I can see the logo. Okay. And Australia, Australia uh, cap. Cap they are is using green. Australian cap. Okay, green cap for Australia. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the batsman is uh, has been gone out. Mm. And feeling uh, um, sight, uh, get the celebrating wicket. Mm. And uh, batsmen are very sad and remove the clothes and uh, go to the room. Stadium. Okay, good. Fine. Good job. Brilliant. 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 Yes. Okay, good job. Yes, brilliant. And uh, let's move on to oh, 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 this is also a cricket photo. Uh, Coralafia. Hey, hello? Yes. Uh, so, could, could sorry, you, we, we don't could, have this kind of sports in Africa, I can say. In Africa, we don't have this kind of sports. So, I but don't know. So, so, South, uh, South Africa is one of the best cricketers uh, in the world. Yeah, his athlete, that I, I would like to clarify. So, mm. uh, so I, I would like to give a hand for my neighbor. So, mm. <laughs> but I, will, I can hear you in a moment. Yeah. You know, um, sometimes back, about a decade back, there was Brain Lara, and he was one of the finest batsmen. Very sturdy batsman. Okay, great. Anyway, so Mr. Koralafia, can you tell us something about yourself? What do you do? Hello? Yes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hello? Yes, Mr. Koralafia. What do you do? So, I would like to give a hand with my neighbor. So yeah. Now, it's about your personal... Uh, uh, it's about an introduction... Just introduce about yourself to us and let us know about what do you do and if you are a student, what do you study or if you are a worker, where do you work and so on. Okay, no problem. Please give me two minutes. Just yeah. Two minutes. yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Take your time. Mm. Mm. Okay, now uh, Somaya El Room. Okay. Yes. Uh, I'm not into uh, this uh, sport, mm. so I don't understand what they do. Mm. But uh, I can guess that this man who's a red, uh, who's wearing mm. a red shirt, mm. um, he check? No, not check. I don't know what is his um job in this sport but i know the meaning uh, in my language so what is it uh, what is the uh, meaning in english what what is that uh, the man who uh, i didn't understand uh, this is sport oh, so okay. no, there is no, a no, man no problem no problem no problem so the man in red oh, yes. is okay let's hear from others and you, you can understand. And by the way, uh, Somia, can you tell me what do you do? Um, what I do? Yes. Um, like what? Uh, are you studying or are you working? Yes, I I'm graduated last year from uh, the university. So uh, I'm still studying. Okay. Something. Good. Good, good, good. All right, that's fine. Uh, Mukhtar, Maximo? Yes, Ninja. Yes, where is your country? My country. Yeah, where are you from? I'm from Somalia. Somalia, okay. All right, yeah. that's good. And what do you do, uh, Mukhtar? Uh, I, I work in... in um, um, in Baja. 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 
Yes. Okay. Good. So fine. Now um, it's time to wind up the lesson. And tomorrow we'll discuss something more about describing these uh, photos and the rules. In general, to describe a photo, we use simple present continuous expressions. Simple right. present continuous tense. Fact... Yes, Javad. Javad Ahmed. Uh, sir, you... Can I explain this uh, picture? Yes. Yes, you can. Go ahead, please. Uh, so I, oh, okay. So this match is um, between playing between England and Pakistan, mm. and uh, I don't know the name of the player, but uh, they hit the ball very hard, and uh, the backside it is the uh, keeper. Mm. So they are shouting because uh, the batsman hit the ball, and the ball is in the air. So the uh, keeper is shouting to catch it, to catch somebody. Mm -hmm. So they are shouting and uh, they are trying to out this uh, man, mean to catch the ball. Mm. Good. Well presented. What do you do, Javad Ahmed? Uh, I'm studying. I think I already introduced myself. I'm a student of BS history. Yes. Okay. Sometimes I... Uh, I think you have changed this name. Uh, you have added something to your name. No, the same doctor. Same? Uh, I okay. made a Google ID, so uh, is, uh, my name is Jawad Sanya and okay. Jawad is Jawad Ahmad. Basically. Okay, uh, good, good, good. Since you are a Pakistani person, uh, you should know the keeper. Yeah. Who is that keeper? Is it... Um, is it... Um, uh, uh, he, uh, yeah, Rizwan, Muhammad Rizwan. Okay, I don't remember actually. Uh, yes, Mr. Koralafia, you uh, the keeper okay, name is okay. Muhammad Rizwan. I'm back, <laughs> yes, I was a little bit busy, so uh, no worries. Did you finish with the picture, yes, we are done with uh, the picture, can, but uh, we just want to maybe know I can about... complete my presentation at the end of this me meeting if you don't mind. Yeah, it's it's finished, it's almost over. Uh, okay, just waiting okay, okay. to hear right. from you. All right. So uh, I will introduce myself uh, normally right now. <laughs> so as I told you previously, uh, um, from being in, in West Africa, mm. I have a bachelor's degree in plant production. In? And plant production. Plant production. Agronomy, plant. Agricultural okay. Departments. Okay. That's really nice. Agricultural okay. departments. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, and. Uh, I work in an NGO, NGO. Okay, non-governmental organization. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Mm. As a technician in agribusiness closer in the rice sector, rice. Mm. In the rice sector. Okay. So it is, yeah. So uh, Mr. Cora Lafia, do you have, how did you get uh, this group information, this class information? Uh, I am in the BBC, I think it is BBC group. I don't know something like that. <laughs> let ah, me check. Learning let me check it on the Facebook. You yeah, mean. exactly. WhatsApp group, BBC Learning Conversation. Ah. Yeah. In WhatsApp. I yeah, never, exactly. I have never posted it. Okay, no, it someone... is some peers. It is some peers. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Someone is sharing my post then. Yes, exactly. I know. Hello? Yes. I posted. Did you? Okay. Okay, okay. That's I really nice. I posted my Facebook so, and... Uh, thank, so, thank you, dear friend. May I know your name? <laughs> my name is Pradavan. Okay, okay. We will chat later in, the, in, the, in this WhatsApp group. Yeah. Then, Pradavan, join me also to that group. Okay. Me too. Okay. Uh, 
All right. So uh, all the members in the group for future link, I think you should join uh, our WhatsApp group, which we have dedicated to this lesson. And I'll give that uh, number in the chat box. So everybody all right. uh, join four six zero nine four seven six four two double six six okay this is my whatsapp number i have mentioned it in the chat box and take this whatsapp number and send me your name and uh your uh, as a surface background a very little a very uh, brief introduction about you just like your name, your country, and uh, your country and your profession. If you are a student, student. If you are a professional, and mention what you do. So I'll advise, and also we have a group separate for professionals like uh, Coralafia. Uh, we have lessons on Saturday and Sunday to discuss professional things. Uh, you can join in that group also. Uh, so I'll I'll give you all the information. So just send me a message through WhatsApp on this number about your name, your profession, and your country of origin. That would be really great. So see you tomorrow, everyone. Now the time is up. And Thank have you a very much. Thank great you. Thank night. You, all right. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir.